Have you ever tried Filipino pandasal? How long did it take you to make these? Not long. Well, I like made the dough last night and let it rise, punched it down, formed it, and then I left it in the fridge so that I was like, when I come back, we'll bake it. All right, so yeah, this it. is the oh, official it. Janelle Eats pandasal. Oh, yeah. Whatever you want, and you can take as much as you want. It's the test. I let it rise even more because in the Philippines, mm. you can tell, you know, the fun is not a little wrinkly. Mm. That means they overproofed it. Mm. So it kind of collapses. But that's what we're going for mm. here. We want it to taste like the Philippines. Mm. No, it is. Mm. Too. Yeah. Anyway, I'm all like passionate about this because I'm like, this is really good. It's good. It reminds me of like when Odessa's dad like yeah. knock, knock at 6 a.m. Okay, guys, here's the pandesal. Mm -hmm. And her dad would give us pandesal in the morning. Mm -hmm. This was like back in 2019. So it nice. was really good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But even this one, like, you make a whole batch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like so excited.